This ring light is doing wonders. Oh, I just love her. Her official name is Glow. Somebody did suggest, suggest that and I just loved it. And I think that it just gives a positive, warm vibe to my face. <laughs> so yeah, her name is Glow. If you wanna give a good shout out to Glow, please do so. She loves all the attention. Um, yeah, she's, she's just bright, bright like a diamond. Gotta love her. Anywho, hello guys. Uh, welcome to my channel. I am Carrie Camp. For those who, I can't speak today. For those of you who don't know me, uh, if you're not following me on Instagram, you can do so. Go to the Carrie Camp, T H E K A R I K E M P. I forgot how to spell my name there for a second. Um, yeah, go on there, follow me. Uh, I do a lot more on there than any other social media. I don't have Twitter or anything like that because who has time? Ugh. Uh, um, but yeah, you can follow me on there. You can like this video, subscribe to my channel. I typically post on Tuesdays and Thursdays lately. Uh, the shipment was late last week for your big sister's closet, so I do apologize for that. Um, I did do a post on Instagram just explaining that uh, there would be no video and I know people were so upset and I'm really sorry. I was equally as upset because I didn't get to choose my Friday favorites until that day. Today's video is Anthropology Plus. So they just, Anthropology for those of you who don't know, just expanded into the plus community. Yeah, um, the reason I like kind of sigh and hum is because it's like, are you doing it because you actually want, uh, that you actually like support plus size women or are you doing it just because it, it's a market right now? Um, a lot of people are using the word trend, it's a plus size trend. Honey, I ain't going anywhere. I'm going to need clothes until I'm 113. That's right. I said it. I'm living until I'm 113. And um, I'm going to... My arm was hurting, so I switched to the other arm. Yeah, I could have put it on the stand, <laughs> but typically I like to just hold it because I feel like that's a little bit more personal. Anyway, um, I just find that a lot of these stores are expanding because it's a market. And I want to see that you actually support the plus size community. Um, so I am going to go there and I am going to do a video and see what their, their plus size clothing is like. I've actually heard some really good things. Um, there have been some other influencers who have done this video um, and put anthropology on their blogs. So I, I'm optimistic. However, again, I just, I really truly hope that they support the plus size community and don't just see us as a market they can tap. That sounded dirty. Um, you guys get what I mean. It's Monday, it's early. Uh, so yeah, let's get to measurements and then I'm gonna show you guys Anthropology Plus. Hey. <laughs> All right, let's get to the measurements. For those of you who don't know, I, I always get DM'd about the opening outfit. Um, so I am going to start saying what the opening outfit is. Just my measurement outfit. Uh, just because I do get asked a lot. Um, so this top is from Nordstrom Rack this year. These bottoms are from your big sister's closet from like Christmas time. They are all sold out of them now. I don't know about this top. Uh, this top is a large. So yay, my top is small. <laughs> so that's that. Okay, let's get to measuring my body. The top, you guys can really see this. This is exciting. Is 43. Look at this bust. <laughs> um, my waist, 38 and a half. I think you can see that. I do my belly. Fifty. And 
And then the biggest part of my booty is 53. Bam. Uh, so yeah, let's get to anthropology. Okay, so here we have the store. Um, this is the plus size selection. I just wanted to quickly film it and show you the amount of plus size clothing that they have. It uh, is at the Dawn Mills location. It is the only location that they have plus size. Um, but I was super impressed with the amount of plus size clothing I had to choose from. A lot of stores, when they expand into the plus size market, um, there isn't a lot of selection, so I was super, super, super impressed with the amount of items I got to choose from. So yeah, let's get trying on clothes! Alright, here's the first outfit that I'm trying on. Uh, I do have it on in the 18W. I, it is $270. I love the flow of it back is super cute the pattern I think it's perfect for summer if you don't like showing your legs a lot of people like just having it at the knee this neckline is super cute as well but I like just just a shake shake a shimmy shake but overall I really like it all right here's the second dress it is a 1x $108 um, I find it a little bit big and for like a 1x usually they fit me pretty good so I would say that this just fits a size to two sizes too big um, but I love the waist detail and how it knots here and then the back it has like a wide belt um, underneath my little back fat here it's folding quite a bit which is not exactly what I would want uh, but I love the way it flows. I love that the pattern changes a little bit here to give it a little extra detail. The color is great. They do have this one in black as well. But, yeah. I just find it a little bit too big for me. Okay, so here's the next dress. It is a 16W. Um, I would say that it fits true to size. It's $200. It is sheer, like you can see like the pattern in my bra and my underwear. Um, so I would just recommend wearing like a white or a nude underneath. I feel like this would be so cute as like a wedding, uh, like bridal shower. Um, just cause it's, or even a wedding. Yeah, you could totally wear this as a wedding dress, but I want to show you it paired with a red belt because I think that like just like a cute little belt to give it a little bit of an edge would be so cute. All right, so here it is belted. Um, this belt is fairly big on me. It's a 1X and it's $45 here. But like to give you an example of what it would look like, I just kind of pulled the belt back a little bit. And it's coming off. <laughs> A little bit too big <laughs> but that's a good example of like what it would look like even like a thicker belt would look super cute but yeah I just I find this like so airy it's like lace it does not have a lot of give um, but you guys see my measurements so you guys would be able to know if you're a little bit bigger in the bust or the stomach or the booty I would just recommend sizing up because um, it probably only has about an inch of room and like I do have a very small bust as y'all know but yeah I really like this one this one's so pretty all right so I pulled together a full look for you um, I have the jeans which are a size 20 they are $200 the jacket which is a size 1x which is $170 and then the shirt which is a 1x which is $70 can't believe I remembered all of that. I don't have a very good memory on the best of days. Um, so let's talk about the jeans first. The jeans are tight. They did do up. I would call them like a mid rise. Like they're not like a super high rise. Usually I'm like used to my jeans coming up to about here. So like a good inch 
higher. Um, they are super tight, but they did say uh, that they give at least half a size, which is I feel would be perfect on me if they did give that. Um, overall, they are super comfy. They're a thicker jean material than I'm used to, so that would be why like the price point is where it is, because the quality is definitely there for the jeans. The jacket is like a suede, and then it's got pockets. I absolutely love the feel of the jacket and the little cuffs. I love this color. This is such a cute jacket. Oh, I just noticed that it has like this thing. That's kind of weird that it has it on that side and not this side. I would think that they would be like matching, you know, like this thing. I'm not even sure what that's there for, to be honest. I don't know. And then give me 30 seconds and I'm going to quickly take off this jacket. All right, so here is just the shirt. Um, it does fit really big, which is a look in itself, right? Like sometimes we like the shirts to fit a little big. I wish that this would allow me to tie it a little bit tighter because I would want a tighter look and maybe like show a little bit of the belly. You guys know me. <laughs> the arms, it has some rouging along the shoulders, which is so cute. It kind of gives it a little bit of character, you know, and it is on both arms. And then here is the back. Oh, where is it? Right here. So I wonder, could I pull it? Yeah, it doesn't really do the off-the-shoulder thing, but... But yeah, there's a total look. It was super cute. I really liked the look that I created. Um, but each individual piece, I really like the jeans. I really love the jacket. This shirt, I would just want a little bit smaller. But this is a 1X, so that's not happening. Okay, so I just wanted to show you this basic tee. Um... To be honest, it feels just like a used t-shirt. It's $54. Like this pocket is just like too big. It's like hanging here. This neckline just looks stretched in my opinion. Um, and then it's got like two little cutouts. But I'm just, it looks like I've worn this 5,000 times and it's just like stretched out and just, not a good look for me personally. Like this is just like hanging out off the side of my boob. Maybe it's like supposed to be off the shoulder, but with the like stretchedness. But ugh. no, not this one. But I do want to say as I'm like wearing the jeans, they are actually starting to loosen and I've only been wearing them for about 10 minutes now. So super impressed with these jeans so far. All right, so now I'm on to this shirt. The fabric is so soft. Um, it's, again, a little bit big on me, quite a bit big on me. Uh, the back is just like a solid. It's got a lot of stretch back there. Um, this is a 1X. My mind left me. I think it's $98. It is $98. <laughs> um, but it is big. I'm not a big fan of like the pattern and then no pattern, you know? I would rather it just be this shirt all the way around. Um, but I do like the neckline has got like a little bit of a frill and then you can like tie it a little bit tighter if you want to make it like a little bit more modest. The arms do have elastics on the wrists. Uh, it's got like a little frill on the shoulder, but It's all like personal preference. If you like it to be looser, maybe this would be a good look for you. You could also like tuck it into the jeans, which gives it a cute look from the front as well. I do like this look actually. <laughs> but yeah. 
All right, so now moving on to the skirts. This one is kind of asymmetrical, so it's a little bit shorter on the side than it is on this side. And last, you can like turn it and make it like a high-low instead and just have the zipper on the side or in the front or whatever you like. Um, I would say that I would size down in this personally so that it looks more like that. I am just wearing a plain black shirt. But it's a super cute skirt. It is an 18 for 170, I do believe. But I love the movement in the skirt and the color. It's like, I don't know if you can really tell how like, it's like a lime or lime, lemon, lemon yellow. I can't even talk anymore. Mondays, got a case of the Mondays. But. All right, so here is the last skirt to try on. Um, it is a 1X and it is 170. I love the bottom hem and how it kind of looks like a flower, like the embroidery on the skirt is. It is a 1X. It is big and it also has like a little stretch in the waist, like an elastic. So it makes it even bigger. Like it's a good couple sizes too big on me. Uh, but overall, I, I think it's really cute. I just like tied up the shirt so that it looked cute with it. <laughs> but overall, I like it. But it's just, yeah. A little bit too big. Ooh. I don't know what that was. Okay, so I just finished at Anthropology, and as I was walking out, I was like, you know what? I really want to check out just like the straight size stuff because a lot of it did fit really big, other than the jeans, the yellow dress with the cute neckline, and the white dress. So the ones that like didn't have stretch fit really well. So I'm like, I'm gonna go through the straight size stuff and their stuff is just so much nicer which really disappoints me to be honest um, like a lot of it was cute but like when you go through the straight size stuff like I want to wear that stuff too you know like it shouldn't just be like a plus size collection it should be like all your stuff should be plus size in my opinion I mean that's just I think that all stores should run from double zero up to a 40 or plus like everybody should have the choice to choose their clothing you know um but overall like the prices were just a little bit high for me that is anthropology like all of their stuff is really pricey um i personally can't afford that but if you can for one lucky uh, viewer you get 20% off. I'll give you the code and you can order online do what you got to do um, But yeah, thanks so much for tuning in. I really appreciate your love your support on all my videos and I'm gonna eat something because I'm hungry. So I'm out of here But I hope you guys have a fantastic week and hopefully I can bring you a video on Thursday from your big sister's closet fingers crossed Take care guys. Love ya. Mwah.